like, have you got that done? Yeah, bro. How's training? All good? Someone else on backup. Got it to find out, I'm Stan. I'm Joe. And we're here at City Kickboxing. We're, we're about to go inside and do some uh, sparring with Kai. He's gonna do I wanna be in this corner to help him spar. <laughs> Is there an actual spar here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not about that life, I'm a keyboard warrior. So <laughs> But that's all with my mouth. Oh we on, let's go. All good? Good. How are you? Good brother. Good, good. Great. So this is it, eh? Hey bro, this is the photo CKB. I mean, so the hard work's done, yeah. and uh, this is where champions are made, so let's go, baby. Let's uh, see what you guys are made of, eh? Okay, let's go with the Not much. Is that us? Not much. Why not? That's bro. How good. Yeah. We just had sparring this morning. Yeah. Mm. Clean the match just for you guys. <laughs> Clean up all the blood. <laughs> no. There's a sign here saying if you bleed, clean it up. Oh, straight <laughs> up. Your own blood. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. We use the walls for like, like you would in the cage, like the back oh, cage. Oh yeah, yeah, just to simulate it. This is one of our coaches, Steve. Hey, how's it going? Good. Joe. Good. Hey, so today what we're gonna do is um, pretty much day in the life of what I do every day, which is pretty much train. Yeah. So we'll jump in the ring, um, chuck on some gloves, have a bit of fun, you know. Not that nothing funner than getting punched in the face. <laughs> oh, mean. Just a uh, just a young Heidi. No, I just have a taste, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're, you're Heidi, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I've actually heard that you've done a bit of boxing back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> Different stand, eh? Bro, that was a big stand. <laughs> <laughs> so just to like the mats, but now I'm like, oh, I'm French off. But yeah, uh, we'll jump in the ring and um, we'll get straight into it. Eh? Mean, let's mean. go. Oh, fine. Let's go. They know what I'm doing. All right, so just a little like quick boxing 101. Yep. Right hand now, just yep. on the phone. Yeah. So what you gonna do? Go to right. Back. Yeah. You gotta turn your right. Right. I'm actually like my lungs is like calling out for help. So what we're gonna do now you're warmed up. Um just gonna have a little play in the ring. Do, do everything you just do about a pads, but now I'm <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh bro, I didn't know what I'm doing. Never tired of big big drunk. Oh wait. Never tired of big big Pretty good, right? Eh? But no, no, I'm just trying to get away from you. <laughs> you guys want to risk each other? Yep. You're comfortable or uncomfortable situation? Turn down. It's hell, um, it's but it's cool to see you in your own environment and sort of see how hard it is, what you got to do, you know? I found it so hard. How do you find it? I can't breathe. Yeah. <laughs> well, Bro, that was only just like a sip of a big, massive drink. <laughs> <laughs> what it's actually like, but, gee, that's me, gee, you're on. No, respect, I just can't imagine, well, I can imagine how you fellas actually train. So, gee, that's why 
You're the champ, G. Yeah. You're the champ, bro. Right? Uh, cool, <laughs> no, shop for coming in. No, respect for you guys jumping in. Giving it a giving it a go. That was on. Where are so oh. Would you ever do that, bro? Like that sort of like um punching, kicking and then straight into everything? Or nah, is it like each day you do like separate things? No, nah, today was gonna be. Oh yeah. So um everything. Everything? Yeah. Working. So you just put your big gloves on and then um MMA round, so wherever the fight goes, or wherever the sparring goes, you just keep going. Just go. Yeah, so up, down, kickboxing. So that's why you gotta be fit if you wanna do uh, this. That's yeah. like benchmark, you know? Yeah. And then you can actually do the techniques. A lot of it, if you don't have the base fitness, then you, it's gonna be a long night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But also, you know what? With boxing, obviously, all you gotta worry about is getting kicked a bunch, you know? Well, with this fight, you got so much more to think yeah. about, you know? That's why it tastes like. Years just to <coughs> up school, like kickboxing, wrestling, jiu jitsu, yeah. kick, uh, boxing, and then put it together. And then, okay, I can have a fight now. Yeah. That's like five years of training. When you're going into a fight, uh, if you're like, if you're better in jiu jitsu and the bro that you're fighting is better in boxing, do you have to study his style? Yeah, like a lot of it is um, strategy. Yeah. But you gotta be well rounded. That's why, like, it could fight end up. But, it could end up anywhere, so you just got to be able to adapt. Yeah. But you know how it would be like walking on stage, it's like a switch. So yeah, like yeah. That's the mentality you have to have. It's like I'm not in there to be friends, you know. Like yeah. we can have be friends after, but when I'm in there, it's like be killed or be killed. Yeah, you know? yeah. So, Ooh, I love that. You got to know you're the like. If you have any self doubt, it's all. That's why it's all mental. If you yeah. doubt yourself at all, you're already lost. Yeah. So when you go in there, it's just full confidence, back yourself. Just commit. man, you're the shit, eh? Yeah. yeah bro. It's so funny you say that, bro, because I was, who I was talking to, anyway, I was talking to someone about you, how you're so, like, nice, like, just, like, calm as fella, and then when you see you, like, fighting, it's just like, it's like you're, like, on a different zone, eh? Yeah. So that's what it is. That's what you have to tap into. Like, when I'm in there, I'm not just representing myself. It's like, I'm channeling all my 2.0, all my ancestors, like, they're right behind me, like, those faces on the wall, those are teammates that have passed away that they're not here anymore. So when we make the walk out and represent City Kickboxing, it means so much more because we're carrying on their legacy now. So when you're in there, it's like, you know, they're always in your corner. So then you just go in, go out there and just lay it on the line, you know? Just go hard. Yeah, bro. So there's a lot of great men um, in this gym and like surrounded by. So um, you just got to harness it, you know? And, yeah. And just use it as wisdom, guidance, and then. Yeah. That's why when you're in here, it's kind of like a marae, it's kind of like tapu yeah, when you're yeah. on the mats. Yeah. You kind of have to respect it because yeah. there's blood, sweat and tears, you know, and teammates that aren't here anymore that wish they could be here, but yeah. now that we're still here, it's like the hour, hour half of training that we have, like you're, you're focused, turned yeah. on. And then after you talk about whatever you want, you know, but well for that training, that's why it's... You're there for the kaupapa there, then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There both, so pretty cool, eh? Brian, that's a literal thing too, blood, sweat and tears. Yeah. Right. <laughs>